Hi, I'm Ash, I'm 24 and I'm from London, England. Um, I've been here for two months. I came January 14th and I leave March 14th. Yeah, I think the training's really good. It's quite intense when I first got here. I was like, okay, going full pace and um, kind of got to be careful to kind of gradually ease yourself into it. Um, but I also think mixing yourself with all these kind of different people is really, really interesting. Like you have me coming from a dance background and you have other people, there's military and people just come out of school. So it's really nice to have this different bond of people all with similar goals and interests at heart, which is the Kung Fu. I think the facilities are great. I mean, you have a lot of um, facilities for you to use. For example, training hall with the punching bags. Everything is open pretty much all the time. So if you want to train at like midnight, you can go out and use the training hall at midnight if you want to. Um, the surrounding area during the winter, since I've been here anyway, it's been quite quiet and peaceful. And recently the uni started back, which is over there. Um, so more lively now, things are becoming a bit more open, you can get uh, more food is available and yeah, it's, it's becoming more lively as the summer gets closer, which is, which is nice. It's nice being here at that kind of time when everything's coming to life again. Yeah, the food's good. Uh, for me, I'm vegetarian, so I don't eat meat. Um, so the kitchen, they kind of cook food for me specially, so they just steam a load of vegetables and I kind of mix that with some rice and some spices and stuff and that kind of suits me fine. But there's quite a lot of variety in the food as well for other people that don't just eat vegetables. Um, and Thursdays after power training we get like a little special treat which is nice, so noodles or fried rice and it's good to have that extra, extra kick of food after some heavy training. So I've had a little bit of experience in martial arts before. I've studied capoeira for maybe like a year just on and off. That was in London. Um, so yeah, Shaolin Kung Fu is quite a lot different to capoeira. Um, some of the kicks are the same, but other than that, that's pretty much all they have in similarities. Uh, but Shaolin Kung Fu is something that I've kind of found interesting through dance because my last practitioner who I worked with kind of mixed um, a style of Kung Fu, not Shaolin Kung Fu, but a different style in with dance. And that kind of made me want to pursue learning different kinds of Kung Fu more. And yeah, this type of Kung Fu is it's quite similar to dance, I think, because a lot of the forms seem to incorporate movement that is found in dance as well. So for me, yeah, it was a good choice to come here and learn this kind of Kung Fu because I can use it. I really like Qigong. We do this uh, every Thursday morning. And it's really nice and peaceful because we go up to the mountain up here and we go through the exercise and it's really nice to kind of link into your inner body because it's all about restoring the inner body and kind of healing as well. And it's nice just to get that kind of spirit, spirituality and contact with the inner body after kind of a heavy week of training. So I think that's my favorite class. If you want to get super fit and have like a great time mixing with different people, learning from actual Shaolin Kung Fu masters, which is pretty awesome, <laughs> then yeah, I'd recommend this place. And the scenery is really nice. I've heard in the summer it gets really hot. So if you want to tan as well, then.
recommend this place definitely to anyone that wants to go above and beyond.